flower vase. So here I have diluted inks in warming alcohol. This is pretty, just the way that made these beautiful patterns in there. What I'm going to use are markers today. Doesn't matter what kind, just use your markers. I like to use the, the chisel tip because there's more uh, ink comes out of them. So What I'm doing is pretty self-explanatory, so I'm not going to talk a lot. cleaning the marker off because it's picking up other colors, which is fine. It's just, it's not exactly the color I wanted. So that's why I'm doing that. I'm kind of staying with the pinks and purples. So what you're doing is just laying a lot of ink down here, different colors. This is gold, pinata gold, and I also uh, got these uh, this media ink from Pent Art, and it's a rainbow color. It gives kind of a neat effect, kind of a sparkly thing going on. So what I'm going to do first is just take a little bit of rubbing alcohol and just drop it on these. Add a little bit of gold. And then a little bit of the sparkly. And it's kind of a weird effect you get from this stuff, but boy, does it stink. It's just nasty stuff. I've got my window open. I don't know what I'm gonna do in the winter, but it's just not a pleasant odor at all. Very strong. alcohol to this I'd like to spread just a little bit more okay and while that's cooking I'm going to use my uh, water brush filled with alcohol and work on the vase part of it what I like to do is to leave a little bit of the background so it looks like it's a glass bowl. So I don't want to go over this whole thing with the uh, water brush filled with alcohol. I don't want to keep some of that background color. <clears throat> Give it a shot of gold because you can never use too much gold. Just 
trying to keep it free and easy. Hair brush, hair brush, hair dryer. do for the bottom is just give it a squirt of uh, more alcohol. I'll just kind of let that move around. Let me come back a little bit on the vase itself and then over. Just grab a little bit of the color from the vase. I'm liking that. So what I'm going to try to do is stop it in its tracks. That's pretty good. And then more alcohol in my spray bottle. Just straight alcohol. And then I'm just going to squirt it a little bit. Give it some. And I may add some stems to that with just another green marker, but there you have it. Thanks for watching.